Hey everyone, so today we are going to do a two minute review of Exploding Kittens, a card game for people who are into kittens, and explosions, and laser beams, and sometimes goats. So, let's get started. You play the game by taking turns drawing cards until someone draws an exploding kitten. When that happens, the person explodes. They are now dead and out of the game. This continues until one person is left and they win. All the other cards can be played or saved to reduce your chances of being exploded by kittens, such as diffuse cards. See the future cards, or cards that allow you to steal from other players. In terms of easiness to learn, I rate this game a 5 out of 5, because all that is involved is drawing and playing cards that describe what they do on the card. On the box of the game, it even says it takes 2 minutes to learn, and there is a link provided on the rules for an instructional video. In terms of length of gameplay, on the box it says it only takes 15 minutes to play, so I'm not going to rate this because it depends on what kind of game you're looking for or how much time you have. In terms of overall setup, all you have to do is set up a deck of cards based on the amount of people that are playing, so I rate this a 5 out of 5. In terms of overall enjoyment, this can be a fun game to play, especially if you're in a time crunch or you're not looking to play an involved or complicated game. Personally, I prefer games that involve more problem solving, thinking, or performing activities than just drawing and playing cards. The game can get repetitive pretty quickly, but there are some expansions that you could buy separately. The cards are pretty funny, but overall, I rate this game a two out of five. In terms of cost, this game is only about $20 on Amazon, which is not that expensive, but for such a simple and quick game, I don't really think it's a bargain. So I rate this a 3 out of 5. For overall score, I rate this game a 2.5 out of 5, with the positives being that the game is easy to learn, easy to set up, and quick to play, and the negatives being potentially limited enjoyment and cost. I'll put the Amazon link down in the description if you're interested. And if there's any other games that you'd like me to review, please leave a comment below. Take care.